Hi family and friends. I am going to show you how I flat iron my hair if the need ever arises. I haven't done it in a couple of months. Well, I did it to see if my bangs grew. But this is how I flat iron my hair if I have to, I don't know, if I just have to do it. So I already did this piece here. And it looks like my ends are choppy and ratty, but they're not. There's no split ends. There's no split ends in here. It's just uneven looking because I haven't had a trim. And, um, you know, if you have a trim, of course, it's going to be straight across. But it's healthy hair and it's healthy ends. And so I had some hair pinned up here. And so I'll just take a piece. And I will comb it out first. I'll comb it out first with this big piece end. Then I'll comb it with this middle, the middle teeth. Then I'll go with the smaller, the smaller tooth comb. I will take my flat iron and I will bump the, the scalp really close. Then I'll put the iron back on the scalp quickly and I'll take a comb and I'll just go down. And the comb is keeping the hair straight so it doesn't crinkle. And it makes your ends nice and straight and they don't make your ends look like um, like a rat's been chewing on them a lot. And so that's that piece straightened here. My color iron is set to 15. It goes up to 25, but mine's only set to 15 because I don't want it bone, bone straight because I have thin hair, but I have a lot of hair. So it's thin, but I have a lot of it, so it's like thick. And so this is how I flat on my air hair. Check your comb. Look at the teeth in between your comb. If you see edges sticking up in between there, um, you need to get rid of that comb. There should not be a seal in there. It should be nice and smooth. So if you see a seal in there with plastic like sticking up in between the teeth, every time you go to comb your hair, that plastic is acting like a little razor blade and it's damaging your hair as you're combing your hair. And so I'm getting ready to wash my hair. So um, I don't mind doing like a quick, I don't know, flat iron tutorial for a couple of seconds. And so I'll comb it with the big piece. Then I'll comb it with the little, well, the medium sized. And then I'll go to the smaller one. And I will go up to the scalp and come down. Wait a minute. I need three hands. And I'll come here. And then I'll move quickly to get my comb. But usually I'm somewhere else. And I'll just bring it down like this. And only go over it one time. So if I didn't get it the way that I wanted it the first time around, then, then oh well, you know, I'm not going to keep firing and flat ironing. But um, that's how I flat iron. Um, you can also add a little curl at the bottom if you wanted to. As you was going down the first time, just go down and just, and you could just bump it under. But I'm getting ready to jump in the shower, so this will revert back. So it's, it's no big deal. But that's just another way to flat iron. If you've never seen it done that way, then you can flat iron it that way. And that's all that I had to share tonight. So thanks for watching. Bye.